Hey everyone and welcome to a little special billboard video. Today we are going to look at some of the possibilities and tricks and tips that you can use with the new billboard system in the game. So this is nothing new, okay? This is something that has been invented, so to say, uh, years ago already. So I'm gonna link a video from uh, Koali Beach actually where I tried this uh, the very first time. Um, so you have some examples what you can do as well, but I did show you some stuff uh, back then already and I will show you some other stuff in a very short video today. So you can see over here we have an aquarium uh, right to our right hand side. You can see the fishies swimming around. We have like a little information board about this little um, bottom of water they are in. We have another education over here with the different types of fish where you can actually get their names and stuff from. Um, we do have a little bit of a different uh, ground pattern here with a bit of a dried uh, stone area if you want and yeah we also do have uh, two different ponds and I did this rather quickly so don't uh, don't get me too hard on this one it's not looking perfect you know um, but over here on the left hand side we have like a little lagoon and on the right hand side we have a bit of a more murky uh, pebble pond if you will and um, you can see on top over here we have the water flowing down there are also some pebbles in here in the water making this all look kind of cool to be honest and I also have a different example for you and this is another little type of aquarium over here um, which uses a little trick um, to create some depth in here and uh, also some in-game bubbles. Um, so you can see after a while the video just quickly resets by the way. So there you go. Um, if you want to make that correctly you would need to have like a perfectly looping one. I just I just filmed something you know for a couple of minutes and then uh, you put that in. But how you do this I will quickly show you. So um, in fact these things are all billboards as you can see the different billboards in the game. This is a screen panel for meters and then you can obviously change the different things and I've got a lot of stuff in here you know I've got some some eyes patterns this is what I used over there there's another one that is a little bit less uh, colorful um, I can show you also down there in a couple of seconds um, I have some sand as well if you know uh, you can use that as sand if you want if you have for example a biome I mean this biome for example is, uh, is a good example because the sand we have in here is not really like the sand you would love to have so you can actually use these things to create a bit of a better sand area if you want so I would then you know just lower it in a tiny bit there you go and then you would basically go in um, and just copy paste that thing next to each other I mean you don't see that right now let me just pull that up again there you go and we're gonna pull that next to it just quickly showing you how you would make like a little sand uh, area it's really not it's not that hard it's just very easy you know just bring them all over here then just select them all bring them down just like that, okay? And then what you have to do is you have to just go in here, make sure that the intensity is all the way down, and then you just dig down where you were, so that's fine, and then you go to flatten to foundation. Ah, well, I think we just need to go a tiny bit deeper. There you go, and then we can flatten the foundation slowly out, and you can see this creates now a little sand pit. I mean, I, I could get the intensity a bit higher, and then it looks a little bit better sooner. There you go, and then you can actually go in with the in-game sand, just like that and uh, you could basically now go in and do whatever you want you can just go crazy with rocks now for example you could now go in and use these rocks make them a little bit oops lighter um, just to match them a ni bit nicer with the sand for example there you go uh, this this might be even a little bit too bright to be honest you just dig that yeah that's fine okay so see this is this is easy and now you could just go in and make that sand pit <clears throat> just look at by the way my voice is I don't know what's going on this is the pollen allergy by the way that nothing to do with the baby the baby is beautiful the baby is just letting us sleep and everything it's insane uh, just you know praising the baby real quick here um, but no this is the pollen allergy and that's not fine it, it still hates me okay so but you can see this is the, this is the idea you get it you know then you would have like a little lovely little sand pit down here and obviously you can put in the in-game sand below and then that's basically how it would work so pretty easy stuff over here you can also see we can now change the color as well of these um, water effects which is kind of cool so you can blend this in nicer with an area like that and you can also then um, go in and choose the water volume over here for example this one and now um, I change it to um, a very low you know transparency there you go so you can make it really like a little murky if you want and then you can you can just play around with the kind of color shade you want to go to you can make it very colorful I mean you can go crazy like that and then you just change the opacity a little bit again you really have to try around how you want to make it the best way possible um, in order to make these things look better you can also try to 
lower them down a little bit more or bring them up a bit more. Just depends on what you like the most. Um, I will just show you the second eyes variant here um, that this already creates like a different one. I just opted for a bit more of some of saturation but you can you can basically do whatever you want you know um, I can recommend to go to some free texture websites there are plenty of them um, just Google for free textures and then you will find plenty of websites uh, that will help. Actually, I do like this other pattern a bit more, to be honest, and then you could just change it. Over here, same goes for this area. Um, I have this water bottom over here and then you can obviously play around with the transparency as well. And in order to make this look better or not, you can also change the depth of, oops, uh, the depth of these things. Um, so you can lower that one down a little bit more. I'm just quickly doing that so you guys get the idea. Um, we're going to remove the water and then we are also going to uh, dig down a little bit deeper until we are back to the pebbles. There you go. I'll just show you that this also looks kind of neat as well. So there you go. We can make the rest of it can be rock. So just maybe blend in a bit nicer. Oh, let me just bring that all up a little bit more. So there you go. That's fine and now we put the water back in so you can see this looks already a little bit different now as this uh, the pebbles are deeper in you can see the water reflections work actually a little bit but let me just uh, change the see this is what I meant now it looks all a bit more realistic and it obviously it depends on which kind of uh, texture you need I just googled for some ones I, I, I'm not the biggest fan of those I would take some smaller pebbles and stuff they are still too big in my opinion um, but you can still vary things a little bit easier here you can see you know Get the transparency a little bit down get the color a little bit different whoops that's a little bit too blue and shiny to be honest there you go something like that. i don't know this is like a bit murky now i can get that up stuff like that you know you can you can just go crazy with it there's there's just so much possibilities and um you can all do this in the game now the last bit i'm going to show you is how you i created this one so you can see there is basically this is the whoops i need to select that one so this is the full setup. Um, you've got this little building I put in. You've got a little water bottom. Um, so we have actual water in here. We've got two little bubbles and then um, you can basically swap that in here again and bring this down and so you have it already. You can also put some lights in here, um, but I think this is a non-lit one. Exactly, this is a non-lit one. You can obviously do the same with a lit panel, which I'm going to quickly show you. Um, this then looks a little bit different as well. So we go to construction and oops, uh, no, that's not right. It's facilities and then to the screens, uh, get rid. Okay, so you see the, I used the non-lit one. Now I'm gonna use the lit one. So let's just uh, pull that over here. I'm not sure if this is correct now. Now I'm going here and I've got the aquarium video. Um, click okay, there you go. And uh, this is the one, I mean, obviously this is the wrong screen by the way, this is, uh, I forgot that I needed to take like a 16 by 9 one. This is now a 4x4. Four four. You can see it's, it's actually square. It's funny because it still works, but it's obviously not, not the right uh, the right orientation on the right uh, proportions. Um, let's quickly do this. Uh, we do have that screen. The lit one. Blah, 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 blah. 4 meters lit. That's the one. This is the one. This is the one I was looking for. Okay, let's put the video in real quick again. And there's the video, okay. And now you just pull that back. And now you can you can also, you know, now I did this in here. We can just pull that into the water bottom over there. So you can see how that looks with some water in front. Let's just do that real quick. See, this looks even better. Now it almost looks like as if there is a, a real aquarium depth effect going on. So it's really dang cool and you can do a lot of different things with it. You can even go more crazy and um, film. And if you have an aquarium at home, I mean, hell, you can make the best aquarium ever because you can film it from all sides and then put it here, here and here. Um, and you can use it as a ground pattern. You can use it as, as I did it over here um, as like a additional pattern the only issue is when you go this way um, it does reflect a little bit so keep that in mind it always looks like it's rainy so I wouldn't overuse them they are also pretty performance heavy so just use them occasionally in water bottoms like those um, maybe in some I will definitely use it for some water streams like that because that looks I think that looks really fantastic um, yeah but this is actually all I can 
all I can say. This is really cool stuff with the billboards. You can, you can do much more as I've shown you in the quality video. So I highly recommend watching that one. But now I really hope you enjoyed this rather quick update on the billboards and tips and tricks how to use them. Um, make sure to always go for good textures. That's half of the job uh, to be done. And then you can mix and match them as an aquarium, for example. You can make also some small exhibits with it, by the way. You cannot only put fish in. You can put whatever insects in. You can put whatever it is in a box, so to say. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed that one and uh, stay safe everyone. I talk to you in the next one and goodbye.